Hi there, hey there, ho there. Now listen, if someone who really loved you, I mean a lot, gave you a totally unique, custom-made, one-of-a-kind gift, wouldn't it make sense and be gracious to receive it with gratitude? Yes. The answer to that question, yes. That's why Linda and I want to encourage you to wake up, if you will, to the unique and amazing gift God offers you when you sleep. Dreams, totally unique, custom-made, one-of-a-kind gifts from God. They've got to be important. Why else would He have created them? He willed them into being. Everybody has to sleep. That's a non-negotiable reality of being a human being. And everyone who sleeps dreams. So if God went to the trouble of creating us with this capacity to dream and to remember them, there has to be a purpose. Grant you, not every dream will have a life-changing impact on you, but some might. Not every dream is a direct message from heaven, but some are. One illustration should be enough to make the point. In the first two chapters of Matthew's Gospel, there are five accounts of dreams, and every one of those dreams plays a significant role in salvation history. Five in two chapters. Of the five, four of them were given to St. Joseph, the greatest saint after Our Lady, a man we know almost nothing about. We don't have a single word he spoke recorded in Scripture, but we know this. God spoke to him and directed him through dreams. And not only did he dream dreams, but more importantly, he heeded them. And obviously, he spoke to Mary about them. How else could we have a record of them in Scripture? So along with eating well, sleeping well, and praying well, listen, the next time you have a striking, memorable dream, why not jot it down and take it to prayer and ask the Lord what he's trying to say to you through it. Now, it may take a little time for you to learn the language of dream symbols, but Linda and I will be here helping you with that with future videos. And I tell you, it will open up an exciting new dimension to your spiritual life. I'm Marcel Dion. Linda and I pray that while you sleep, if not tonight, really soon, an angel of the Lord may visit you with a word of encouragement and hope from the Lord who loves you so very dearly. Thanks for watching.